seven. What is going on? I have a special unboxing today. Yesterday was my birthday, and I didn't get to celebrate it because everyone was busy. So I'm gonna be celebrating during 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 the weekend. You know, my, um, one of my family asked me what I want. I just said money. So I'm gonna wait till I get birthday money to pick this up. But I want to be Richardson in my job. No, like no, like a couple avenues near my couple avenues away from my job. But this is one thing I wanted on my list. I think I wanted for the switch was the bone, the bone edition, the Sonic Forces, Bayonetta Two, Xenoblade Chronicles, or Dragon Ball Z Universe Two. I wanted Zelda because it's a good game. I wanted Zelda. It was a good game, but I only wanted it to get the Explorers Edition. Because this is like. When we were playing Zelda, because I played. One of them for the DS. I played that for, for, 50, for 45 minutes. So that. I downloaded the, the first Zelda game that came out, ever came out. I got it free from my Nintendo, Club Nintendo. Played it for like 10 minutes, I stopped. I don't hate Zelda, but I don't know why I don't play it. Because Pokemon's always been my life, my favorite games, you know. I always, nowadays, I just buy games that has online playing. Like the last game I bought that had online, that had good story, was Fire Emblem Fate. And no, Birthright, no, Birthright, yeah, and that was my first Fire Emblem I ever bought. Didn't beat the game, but I love it. And if I Fire Emblem, that could be game for the Wii the anniversary was the last game that I played that had story. And most of my games almost all of them. So I saw the Valley, so I saw Star the Valley. It's all I play. You know, I saw, I, I saw a lot of games that, that had story. This game made about 10 out of 10 in my game of the year. And I said, I was going, I went there to the store. I said, I'm going to go there for a brief moment, like a good two minutes. See, see what they had. You know. Just cause, see what they had. And I saw this, I'm like, bro, they had two of these in life. Cause I was on my phone going on long, like, Walmart had it, but they don't live in, but there's, there's one, no, there's not in New York. I don't know if you could do online purchases. Obviously, they had this on eBay and Amazon as well, but people was buying them. And some of them for like $120. No, 60 bucks for this? I'm gonna jump at this, but two more, where they had a lot of these, but two more, but this one they didn't. Like, bro, I need to get this. And, like, $7,500, no. Just, just jump you, bro. You're not, you're not even collectors. Stop doing this shit. Like, bro, anyway, I had to pick this up. When I saw this, I was going to, like, I was going to take a birth money to get this up, but when I saw this, I'm not going to play it yet, but when I saw this, I had to pick it up. Because if I didn't buy it, this would have been sort of, too late. I was thinking to myself, I should get Zelda, or should I wait? I said, I said to myself, whispering, I should pick this up. Like, boy, there's only two of these left. And this is that PC, PC and Richard the Sun. I went there the last week. They barely had no games. I went to Target. Had like, even Nintendo World when I bought my Pro Controller. They didn't even have it. So I'm like, I need to pick this up. I had to. GameStop, you know, they don't have this at all. Like, GameStop, I don't like buying games like that unless if it's brand new or factory sealed, like, on launch day. If it's not wrapped out of plastic, I'll buy. If it's not wrapped, it's not wrapped out of plastic. You no, know, if the game's been GameStop isn't like unwrapped to tear out of the plastic, I'll buy. Unless it's like an old plastic game, or if I want to get used, I'll buy, I'll buy games brand new from them. If it's not wrapped up in plastic, I don't like the button, like bro. This game is hype. Ten out of ten. Or I'm not to get another DLC. Probably gonna play this game first before I buy the DLC. Because I want to wait some time to get to get to like some time to spend money on DLC. Cause I asked soon to we're gonna get that DLC. A Donald Sonic Mania. Probably gonna get that DLC. I wait to some time get this. I hope the game's long. But I had to get the, I had to pick this up. I had to. I had to. <clears throat> Let's see if I can box this. Like I took. Someone involved just to see from the side. But too bad that this shit. Like, I'm not gonna, like, lay it. 
I'll probably wait. I'm gonna keep this on for now. Just cause. I'm one player mode. The graphics game is good. This game won game of the year. Mario Odyssey from the second. To be honest, I wanted Mario, I wanted Mario Odyssey to win game of the year, but this isn't like more from like teens and adults. And more is like for kids. And you know, like, it's more is great. But a lot of people who's into like games that's in, like their age or grown ups, not into like kids stuff anymore. Unless they're like little kids, then they ain't into like kids stuff like that. And that's why it's one game of the year. And, I, and, I, I'm, and I'm happy it did one game of the year. I'm glad in the Nintendo game one game of the year. Beat the PS and beat the PS4 games. It be for Horizon, the other whack shit, and Persona 5. And you know I love anime. Like, bro, I'm glad Nintendo, like, this is. Getting right here shows how much power Nintendo has in the consoles. They had games on NBA 2K18 that I bought. Portable is amazing. Game like Zelda about the Wild is what the Switch is all about. Like, like when Smash Bros. come out, it's a wrap. When that new Pokemon game come out on the Switch, it's gonna be over. But the Wild can display how good the graphics is on the console, on handheld and TV mode. You know the other games on the Switch are gonna be good. I waited for a long time, but I'm just happy to be a finding guy. And I got not, and I got the, the edition. Cause when we come with the book, I played the demo at Best Buy last week. It was good. Played a little bit. It was good, great. But this book gonna give me a start, which I need. Cause like I said, I'm actually new to Zelda. I know who Zelda is, obviously, but I'm actually new to this. But let me start talking unboxes. <laughs> Cause this is the thing, the map. Oh my god, it's the map. That feels amazing. I like it too. It looks like the map. I like, I like, I like this cause this reminds me of the papers that they have on the show called. called Survivor, which I watch. Like, I like the old map, but I like it. There's gonna be too much in it, because I'm just gonna do the unboxing. You know, but when I play it, when I finally play the game, that's when I'll do this and all that. The book itself. No. No, I'm not gonna read this yet. So I'll play the game. I'm not gonna play it yet. It's the game itself. See, this is different. Do you like the Splatoon one? Like I said, this is not physical game. This, this game had to be physical. Like, boy, has everything in it. 13 gigabytes is digital. Nah. I have micro SD card. But I want to save it for other games. I feel like it's worth digital. Oh my god, we're at the wall. Like I said, I'm going to take your birthday money to get this, but I had to pick it up. Because it's going to be sold out. Like, I'm going to unbox the game. When I put it, but I'm not gonna put it in my game system yet, or put it in my cartridge box at all. I'll unwrap the plastic. I was gonna unbox it of it. Hopes it hurts. but no. Oh wow, that that was it. There was more. Well, so I'm gonna play it. I'm gonna leave it in the box for now. And when I play the game, I just wanna take it out. I'm gonna wait to, wait to get some birthday money. So I could, you know, just cause I kinda, I didn't overspend, but like, just cause this is birthday gift I don't want, you know, like, I can't, I can't wait to play this for real. If, I know this game is gonna be great, and this game right here probably gonna want me. It's literally gonna make me go back to other game stores and get games that has good story mode. Yes, I'm gonna Smash Bros. the Pokemon game, obviously. But besides that, and maybe Dragon Ball Z is Zero Two and downloadable content. I don't know what other games that has online play that I'm gonna get for my Switch. Like I, I really don't. 
So besides Pokemon and Smash Bros, I could be picking up some other games that had a good story. But like, I bought Stardew Valley, I believe, the other week. Love that game so much. I'm gonna play it on a handheld mode. I'm loving it so much. Addicting. This game right here is one of the games that 95% of my time, I have to play this, this on TV mode. I'll play it on handheld mode. If I want to play that bad, or I'm on the trip or outside. But when I'm at home or I have access to the TV, this game got me in TV mode. So I probably we won't play this game that much on handheld mode or tabletop mode. But when I get the chance to play it on TV, this has to be on the TV mode. Because that graphics though, like I said, if this game will show good graphics, then the Smash Bros. and Pokemon, you know, it's gonna be good. My Odyssey amazing as well. Like, bro, this right here will make the Switch the best console. Yes, there's a lot of games on the Switch, the third party that's not the best graphics, but you get portability mode. But, like, we get a better hardware Switch. I feel like it could be the P4 Pro. And I, and I like P4, I'm not gonna lie. But Sony's a bitch. Yeah, and ass. What they say in the comment about cross platform play, then yeah, ass. Microsoft, I hate them. I hate them. Xbox One X, really one of the best consoles, but the best console out there with no new games coming out like that. This game's coming out, but not like the Switch or PS4. It's barely any new games coming out that interest Xbox One. I feel like Xbox One X is not a bust because it's the best console, but. It's not great because not a lot of games coming out with it. Like, like when the PS4 Pro came out, even now they're still making games for the PS4 and supporting it. Xbox One X or Xbox One not getting a lot of games coming out. But here you go. Inside. Woo! That smell that smells good. The culture smells good. Take it, take it, take it out. But the wild. I don't know if the regular version of the game has the same exact cartridge skin, or is this cartridge skin exclusive to the the, the, the exclusive to the explorers, or the limited editions that came out on launch day? Like I said, got the game. Pretty pumped. I'm right, not gonna play it yet, but sometime like before the month ends. On like maybe on like the beginning or the first day of or the first day of May, this game will be getting played. That's a promise. And the, and I got my post on as well. That's a promise. Dog, both to eight seven. Like, comment, subscribe, and peace out.